You're watching News 8 on WROC. Clay Harris from Uniting and Healing Through Hope of Monroe County is with us. Clay, thanks for a few minutes. Thanks, Mark. Thanks for having me. Um, greatly appreciate it. And, um, you know, it's sad that I have to be here to talk about, you know, this subject matter, but it's a very important and a vital one for our community. Our focus is your focus. It's the Stop the Violence campaign. This afternoon, uh, an important event will take place. Tell us what you've got planned. Well, we kind of called it an emergency press conference, to be honest, Mark, because um, the church on Merrimack Street uh, two evenings ago, when we were actually having our faith conference dinner, Stop the Violence Faith Conference dinner, we learned when we got out of there, the church got shot up and one of the parishioners inside got shot. We're going to have a press conference there at 3.30 to show solidarity, you know, with the church and with churches in general. And of course, where our general community, we want everyone to come out. Someone that day was holding the gun and pulled that trigger. How do we reach that person and stop them from taking that type of action? Well, herein lies the quadrillion dollar question and answer. The answer that I have, and the only answer that I know is remotely possible, is we got to reach their hearts and their minds. And, and, and they, we have to, we have to supplant this hard heart and this, this, this darkness of a heart, this, this non-conscious of life, the non-value of life with the love of Christ, to be quite honest with you. I don't know no other way. And there's no other uh, love that's greater than the love of God and the love of Jesus Christ. And if we can sit down and share by by coming together and strategizing and bringing solutions to the table is, is what we're about to do, we'll be able to reach these folk, whoever they are, and they're primarily young people. And we got to reach their families and we got to let them know that there's a better way and life is precious, is sanctity, and we have to save it, including theirs. You'll take an important step coming up on June 5th. Tell us what you have planned that day. Well, June 5th, we have uh, uh, marches and rallies planned throughout the city. Um, we want people to participate. You go to our website, uh, www.unitingthroughhope.com, uh, unitingthroughhope.com, and uh, it'll give directions and understanding what we're trying to do. We're trying to bring every facet of the community, every town and every village, whether you live in Pittsburgh or Henrietta or Chi Lai, uh, or Brighton we, or the four quadrants of the city. We want to bring us all together because we all are a family. We're all a community and we have to come together and not take this as being normal. And we have to put things in place to change it, but we have to take a stand. If we do take a stand together, we can make a difference, Mark. Clay Harris, Uniting and Healing Through Hope of Monroe County. Thank you. For more on this conversation, if you missed any of it, we'll have it posted online at rochesterfirst.com.